Hi, my name is Tom Casey, and I wanted to do a quick short video today on your limousine company. Basically, the purpose of this video is just to compare you with one of your competitors in terms of where you show up in search results when people are searching for limo service in Atlanta. And I'm only going to cover two factors with you today because I want to keep this video short. But before I jump into that, I want to show you how many people are searching online for limo service. This is a tool from Google. It basically goes out and does a monthly count of search terms and gives you an average. Um, and what I've done is I've gone back four months from February just to show you how many people are searching in Atlanta. This rounds up to the nearest hundredth or tenth. But anyway, let's look at November, 1300. December, 1000. January, a little bit below 500. February, back up to 1000 again. That's a lot of people searching for limo service, okay? So I thought this would be a good exercise. So what I did is I went over here to Google did a search for limo service in Atlanta. This is page one, okay? Let's see where I find you. You are over here. There you are. This is your uh, website, Atlanta-Limos for Ambassador Global. And you are on page four, okay? So, again, just gonna cover two factors today. These are two factors search engines consider when they're doing rankings. They obviously consider more than two, but again, we're gonna keep this short. What I wanna do is use those two factors and compare you to somebody on this page. I wanna see if there's any differences with those two factors between you and someone over here. And if there are differences, if there's anything that can be done about it to help you out and move you up in search rankings. So for comparison, we're gonna use Hennessy Transportation, this guy right there. And the very first factor I'm gonna talk about today something called citations. Now a citation is a listing for your business in a directory site. It's a name, address, phone number listing. I'm going to give you an example. This website here actually goes out and finds directory sites. Here's one called Local Dispatch. So if Ambassador Global had a listing on Local Dispatch, name, address, phone number listing, that's considered one citation. Search engines like citations. The more, the better. They feel it makes you more legitimate as a business, therefore they want to rank you higher than someone who has fewer citations than you do. Now at the top of this page, we actually can do a citation count for your business. I put you in here and it's telling me you have 36 citations. Hennessy has 135, so almost 100 more than you. But the good news is this. You can quickly and easily get added to these directory sites. So this number 36, that can get bumped up to 60, 70, 80, 90 in short order. And if we do that, it's going to give you a very nice positive boost in search rankings. You definitely would move up just based on the additional citations. Okay? So that's citations. Let's talk about the second factor I want to run by you today, and that's called backlinks. Backlinks are important. A backlink is a link from one website to your website. As an example, there was a website called AtlantaLimosupplies.com and on their website they had a link to Atlanta-Limos.com which obviously goes to your site. That's considered one backlink. Search engines like backlinks even more than they like citations. Again, for similar reasons. They feel it makes you more legitimate as a business therefore they want to rank you higher than someone who has fewer backlinks than you. Now this website here actually does a count of backlinks for your site. And the number we want to look at is unique active, okay? It's telling me you have one unique active backlink. Let's go look at Hennessy. Okay, so they have 38. Obviously, that's quite a bit of a difference there. But again, there's good news. We can add backlinks to your site, okay? What we want to do is we want to get this score up to closer to what Hennessy's is. This should be closer to high 20%, low 30%. Link influence score is an indicator of how strong the backlinks are that are coming into your site. It's based on how strong the website is that's linking to you. The better and stronger that website, the higher that score is going to be. Okay? So what we want to do for you is add maybe just 10 good quality backlinks from good quality websites. Get this score up to low 30%. That would be huge for you. <laughs> you would really jump in the search rankings. Definitely would get, would get a nice boost. Okay? So that's citations and backlinks. The only two things we talked about today. But you found out that, yeah, there are differences between you and someone on that other page of Google. You're also finding out, though, that there are steps we can take to eliminate and reduce those differences. And when we do that, with just these two factors alone, give you a very nice positive boost in rankings. Okay? So, I hope you found this was helpful. This is what I do for a living, but I don't charge for consulting. So, if you want more information about what I talked about today, that's free. 
If you want me to discuss my factors that I do with my other customers regarding rankings, that's also free. If you want me to review your website, that's free as well. There's no cost, there's no obligation. So anyway, go ahead and give me a call if you'd like, or shoot me an email, and we can go from there. Have a great day. Bye now.